let's take a moment and discuss the essential hunting gear that you will need out in the field. Now there's a lot of gear that you can have inside your pack, whether it's your day pack here or an overnight pack. But let's start with the basics. What do we need while we're out there? Well, safety first. So when we're out in the field, we'll always need water. So having a good hydration pack is the perfect place to start. And these will always fit in the day pack and your overnight bags. From there, let's move on to our first aid. There are a lot of really great pre-packaged first aid kits available on the market. And this will have almost all that you will need in case of an emergency. However, I personally like to add a few more things to my pack. This is mine that I carry out in the field and you can see that's nice, small, lightweight and I can fit it easily even into my day pack. So there's no excuse not to have this even if you're going to be gone for camp for just a few hours. In addition to our survival pack, our first aid kit, I like to have what's called a bivy sack. These, in my opinion, tend to work a little bit better than, say, your space blanket because they last for a longer period of time and they're easier to open if your fingers are cold. Although we might have a GPS, it's always great to have a backup compass. You will also notice that this compass comes with a signal mirror. This is going to be used for signaling over flying planes or helicopters that are maybe in search and rescue mode or for other people that you'll see in the field. We never know if the batteries might die or if we can't get service due to overhanging trees. So having a compass is a great tool to make sure that you have in your pack. To go along with that, having a whistle to call out to other people that may be in your path, in your area, or if you need to get somebody's attention. This right here is strictly in case of an emergency. It's called quick clot. This is only if we have a traumatic event where we need to stop bleeding quickly, but always make sure to have it in your own personal first aid kit. This right here is a filter system. You can use this to filter water that you find in the field and get more water either for your camelback or in this case, drink straight through the apparatus itself just by drinking through the end of the straw right here. There are several different tools out there on the market for getting clean water from tablets to these type of straws, even UV pens. Figure out which one fits your pack best and your needs. Finally, I always like to have in my pack a multi-tool. It has the pliers, the crimps, the cutters, knives, a saw, every single last tool you can need in a compact form. Now, I'm gonna show you exactly what I have in my pack and prove that you can fit everything that we just shown here into a smaller case. I've opened up my pack and I have my UV light for creating clean new water, my multi-tool, my whistle, my quick clot, even a snake bite kit, survival blanket, a fire starter, gauze, medicine, and all sorts of first aid all in one small package. So again, I cannot stress this enough. Even if you're heading out into the field for just a few hours, always make sure to have your first aid kit in the pack every time you leave camp. 